parents' house. Slept for a few hours. I'm about to go and weigh myself now. Last time I weighed myself was on Monday and I weighed 179. And then Wednesday I weighed 175. I had lost four pounds then. And so today's Friday and let's see what I weigh today. 175.6. Seeing a number like that can be very discouraging, especially because on Wednesday I was one seven or yeah, I was one seventy five point two, and today I'm one seventy five point six. So it could be very discouraging, but I'm pretty sure it has a lot to do with my sleep, my water, and also just like the lack of sleep. Because when I was losing weight, I was sleeping about eight hours consistently so when I haven't had that and so I just try to like sleep like whenever I can and stuff so I'm pretty sure sleep has a lot to do with it as well so as long as I feel like my clothes is fitting really well like my jean shorts are getting like a little a little looser I feel like my arms are getting like a little better now and my face isn't as like round and everything like as long as I feel really good and I see that things are fitting better then I'm fine yeah that number can be a little bit discouraging but don't let it get to you at all you know just keep working really hard and your numbers are still going to be going down and your jean sizes are going to be going down your clothing's going to be going down so just keep working at it really hard and you will end up looking bomb anyway yep i uh, just woke up <laughs> and i'm about to go and have breakfast with my parents and my eggs downstairs and here's my breakfast so i have two eggs and then with veggies on top, which are just like bell peppers and onion, and then with a toast, wheat. And then I have some pineapple on the side here. I'm not gonna eat all of that, obviously. I'm just gonna have like a little bit, but there's my breakfast. All right, just got to the gym, and I'm so excited to get my workout on, baby. Woo, Kimmy! All right, let's go work out. All right, so I just finished up doing Stairmaster for 10 minutes. I was at level seven for 10 minutes, and then the last like 30 seconds, I did level 10. Now I'm about to go work out legs. Now I'm on the leg press, and I have 45 plates on each side here, and I'm doing eight to 10 um, reps. I'm gonna do a total of four sets, I'm about to do my last one right now. Now I'm on the leg extensions, and I'm doing 40 pounds on here. I am doing four sets, 10 to 12 reps. leg curl machine here and I am working out my hamstrings and currently doing 30 pounds so I can't remember exactly what I used to do on this hamstring machine thing but 30 pounds is okay it's all good now I'm on the seated leg curl and this is what it looks like and I'm currently doing 30 pounds hurt like crazy so I'm just gonna finish up doing lunges and then after that I'm gonna go tanning I'm just trying it out for a few days see if I like it or not get him on so me baby get him on so me baby Good morning. Today is Saturday and I just got here to the gym. Maddox is at home with my parents while I come to the gym real quick and I'm gonna do some cardio. This lens is really bothering me. It doesn't fully open up. Pretty stoked. Do I look tired? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. I don't, yeah, I do. Ooh, put my glasses back on. Can't wear these during the gym though. All right, time to go work out. Just finished up on the treadmill. I did 20% incline at levels like three actually the highest was level three, so three miles per hour. And I was just kind of going like from side to side, and I was jogging uphill, and then I was walking backwards. So just a little bit of everything, and I did it for 15 minutes. So I did end up um, upping up my cardio 
by five minutes and I burned 184 calories. So now it's time to go and work out my biceps and my back. So today is back and buys. Just finished with the gym and I didn't show, I don't think I showed like my strength training, like weights and stuff because, oh, cause it's Saturday today and it's really busy. All I did was, let's see, I did cardio, you saw that, and then I did weights. For the weights I just did, wait, where's the car at? Where's the car, what the heck? Wait, where'd I park? What the heck? Oh, I'm in my parents' car. Oh my gosh. Totally forgot I'm in my parents' car and not my car. Anyway, I did cardio and then I worked out my biceps and then worked out my back. Then I did some tanning and now I'm about to go back to my parents' house. Really cool fact, I have dropped down 2%, not 0.2, but 2% body fat. Um, I took a photo of it and I'll put it on the screen right here so you can see it. But yeah, I did end up dropping 2% body fat. I'm pretty stoked. And then today I'm actually a pound less. This morning I weighed in at 174. So this week, so I started this whole entire thing on Monday and then today is Saturday. Uh, since Monday I have dropped five pounds and I have also gone down 2% in body fat. Damn, I'm, 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 on, I'm like on a roll. I'm doing really, really well and I'm really excited about uh, this really amazing progress that I'm doing. I'm working my butt off and it's really paying off. Work, work, work in our business. Work, work. A busy, busy, busy. A busy, busy, busy. A busy, 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 busy. I just finished working out. I did 15 to 17 minutes of cardio and I just walked on the treadmill 15% incline at 2.5 speed. I didn't record because I was feeling really just like tired and drowsy, lazy, with like no energy because yesterday was Thanksgiving and I ate like a little bit of everything and I had some pumpkin pie and so today I was just kind of like, what's that called, like the food coma or whatever where I'm just like really tired. And I was like, okay, even though like I feel like crap and I feel bloated and just like, you know, just like crap, I need to go to the gym and I need to go do some cardio so that way I get some like, you know, I can feel good after and I have like really good energy and everything and honestly it really did help so I did the 15 to 17 minutes of cardio and then afterwards I walked into the dry sauna I was in there for about like five to seven minutes and just listening to my music and just to kind of like sweat it all out and everything so I didn't really see but I just needed to get to the gym even though I felt like crap and I not really I wasn't really in the mood to go to the gym but I was like I know if I go to the gym I'm gonna end up feeling a lot better my day will go up will be a lot better so but overall thanks Thanksgiving was really great. It was Maddox's very first Thanksgiving and I didn't do a lot of vlogging. You know, I didn't record a lot because I wanted just to have like a family day. Like I wanted to really just enjoy Maddox's very first Thanksgiving and, and also just like as a family. So, but I did take a lot of photos. So I'll be sure to share those photos with you guys here in this video. It was really fun. So I went to Tommy's house first or Tommy's parents' house. Then I went to my family's. I did eat a little, you know, a little bit of a lot. We really did enjoy ourselves and it was a really great family Thanksgiving. I am so ridiculously tired. Tommy's almost off work, but I'm gonna go to the gym. I feel like I'm going to the gym today, like these past two days, just to get into like a better, just to have like better energy and just to be like in a better mood. But I am drinking my pre-workout because obviously this super duper helps. So. so I'm gonna go to the gym and just do like 15 minutes of cardio and then come back home. I just need it just to boost up my energy and because it's Saturday, I need to be like in a really good mood. So taking my parents' car, and about to head to the gym. Probably not a great idea to bring my camera into the sauna, the, what is it called, the dry sauna. I feel a whole lot better. I worked out for 15 minutes, did cardio, and it was just like at a steady pace. I 
put the incline at 15% incline, walked at 2.5 speed, and I just walked for 15 minutes. I just feel really good, and every single time that I end up, you know, being really lazy and stuff, I just tell myself, okay, I need to go to the gym and just do some cardio, and then I get like this really good, positive energy. It just makes my day a whole lot better, so if you feel like really lazy, even if you feel bloated, like I do right now, I feel like, I ended up eating so much during Thanksgiving and I don't feel the best, like I'm not in the best shape of, like right now or anything like that, but I know, like I feel like, like really bloated and everything, but I was like, screw it, I'm just gonna go to the gym even if I don't feel really good, you know, about like my body right now, I'm gonna go to the gym and I'm gonna sweat it out and it really did end up working and it ended up helping, so as you can tell, I'm like so happy and like excited, I just feel really good and um, I'm glad that I do have the gym like by my parents house to be able to go. I think there's people coming in so Okay, yeah, there's people coming in so I will talk to you guys soon